Hi again, everybody. It's me, Lisa. Today, or right now, I am going to share with you another large unboxing of samples, homemade, like, um, made samples from little mom and pops or people from, that sell on Etsy, all their craft wares. Whether it be soap, shampoo, lotions most of the time, candles, tart waxes, or wax tarts, um, just all kinds of stuff like that. But we'll see what's in here. I ordered a small one from them last month because they were sold out of the big boxes. And this is how big the box is. It is there. Um, I thought it had a size on here. It doesn't. It usually does. Well, anyways, this is their bigger box. And um, when you open it up, it comes pretty well cushioned. There's some bubble, bubble wrap. And in it is, and they usually set aside their um, their edible from their non-edible. That puppy's actually pretty heavy. And I'm sorry for the noise. I hate this no listening to this noise on YouTube for some reason. You can't hear the person talking. So I will stop and talk between crinkles. Oh my. I'm just gonna dump it out and then show you one by one. It'd be easier that way. Oi. Sorry. <sighs> okay. So we will show you the first thing, paper. <laughs> the next thing, oh, cute. Oh my gosh, I am going to have to buy some of these. They are from, I don't know if they have a website on Etsy, it doesn't say, oh yes. It's called Sandy Pop Lollies. It is a martini or maybe a Cosmo, whichever you prefer and it does contain milk, soy, and peanuts. I guess maybe this is um, not a martini, but a margarita, because it has like the, the uh, salt or sugar, if you prefer, around the rim. That is so cute. I would like to order these. I, I do bunk, we do bunko once a month, and my turn is coming up shortly. Although I don't know how well those would last, considering it's July coming up. They may not ship very, may not make it very well in transit. <gasps> oh, yum. OMG. A cake pop. Okay, what rock have I been living under that I have never, ever tasted a cake pop? I know people who make them, and people who eat them say that they are yummy. How cute is that? Or yummy looking is that? Should I hide these? Should I share some of these? I don't know. You tell me if I should share them or if I should eat them all myself. And this, that's the name of the company is a cake pop and you can find them on Etsy if you just Google and they've got all kinds of other different ones. They have they've got custom ones of owls and they've got little, I don't know if you can see that very well at the bottom, but it looks like they've got all kinds and it says that they do contain eggs and whole wheat. So be warned. And this next one, super cute again. Treats for my sweets. And this is from Etsy as well. Looks like Cinderella's glass slipper as pink. Very sweet. And this one, candied cakes. Handmade candies, cakes, and other sweets. Oh, cute. Edible sugar jewels. That's the name of the, of the um, candied cakes is the name of the shop on Etsy. Came in another little plastic wrapper. Now open it between talking. And she has, or they, I shouldn't say she, I'm, I'm going on assumption and that's a bad assumption to use. Oh. They've got jewel candies in here. They look like emeralds. How yummy. And they're all different shapes. This one. 
is known as an emerald cut. This one is, um, oh, I can't think of that. Like a, maybe cushion. No, not cushion. I'm gonna pop one in my mouth just because I can. Oh, okay. Good. These are gonna be gone by the end of the day. These are so good. Yum, yum, yum. Again, that was candied cakes, handmade candies, cupcakes, and other sweet treats. Mm. Okay, I'll try not to talk too much. Oh, and I get a buy one, get one free promo. If I use her code. The next thing is, oh, I didn't know they had so much candy in here. Or so many treats, I should say. Is Carl's Candy Company. Okay, I'm not gonna go on the assumption that this is a woman by the name of, unless it's a woman named Carl, who knows? And this must be a lot like the last one that I showed you because, I can't tell. Looks like they're stuck together, but they're very pretty. I don't know if these have flavors, but if you wanna know how they taste it, just ask me below in the comments and I'll let you know. And two more. The next one is a, it's from Crawford Street. It's a Blondie cookie. Nice little size. Perfect. Uh-oh. Thanks a million. Enjoy your fresh baked cookies. I'm so glad I ordered, I ordered this like about a week ago. And um, I think it came Monday? What's today? Wednesday. So I ordered it last Tuesday and it came on Monday. And this is what was in it. Looks like kind of a candy M&M's. Candy cookies. Chocolate candy. If you want to be generic. Okay, no. There's more than one sample. I don't know what they're trying to do to me. But they all look yummy. Cassiosa Crafts. Baked goods from the heart from the heart, found, lo found locally in Portland, Oregon, brought to you by Ashley Quintana. And you can find them on Cassiosa Crafts. And it's got a list of the ingredients, which is always nice for people with allergies. Ooh, m, &M cookie. And looks like peanut butter. Brown sugar, no, not peanut butter. Must be a ginger of some sort. Looks yummy. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, okay. Now onto the big box. Okay, this is gonna take forever. I'm sorry, I'm gonna rush this along. Those treats just really blew me over. So, I think I showed you, it came in a cute little ribbon. And out of the box sampler. Um, if you go to <laughs> out of the box, I believe it's out of the box dot com, out of the box sampler dot com, you can get your own. And it's kind of nice. This one, I like this because it lists all the different um, people who participated and it shows the promo codes all in one sheet instead of looking around trying to figure out what what you did with the package. That helps a lot more pretty crinkly paper okay first thing on top here is oh cute I'm sorry I say that way too much is from ah, a penny for your thoughts cute I know it's a little clip you can do whatever you want with that you can use it as a chip clip you can put maybe um, a magnet on the back, hang it up on your refrigerator. How cute is that? And it's got a little card in there. So I'm going to assume that they make cards and other things. And this is from Penny for your thoughts. That's for you are thoughts at artfire or um, dot artfire.com. I think it's at artfire. Uh, no, it would be dot artfire.com because that's address not the email Lisa okay oh hickory rich primitives oh. ah. Ah. 
Can't get it open. Okay. This thing is Lisa proof. You know what? Heck with it. Rip it open. And this is from Hickory Ridge Primitives. Doesn't say much more than that. Oh my gosh. These are all tart samples. Oh, that smells good. Kind of fallish. This one is called Settler's Cabin or Settler's Cabin. As we don't pronounce our T's up here very well. And these are all Settler's Cabin or Settler's Cabin. However you want to pronounce it. And these are all the same. Oh, these are awesome. I'll have to share these either with my daughter or my mom. They all have tart warmers, as everybody should. And the next thing, oh gosh, it's gonna take forever than the last sample box I did. This is by, oh, I don't know. I can't read it. Oh, Dia G, Dia D, it's D I A D I I I. Oof, I suppose they want something catchy. How cute. That's a little cotton, cotton bag, kind of like a little burlap bag, a little tie around it. And it said face food. So I'm assuming it either face wash or face cream. Let's see. Face food sample. That's all it says. I don't know. I'm going to put my glasses on here so I can read this. Handmade in small batches, raw and organic. Um, that's the name of their Etsy shop is Dia D D I A D I I. And it does not really say what this is. Very tiny print. If you can read that, uh, good one on you. The next thing I will pull out is another tart sample. It's a little footprint. Cute. And this is from, I'm going to go real quick here if I can. This is from, oh, six white ties. I got one of these in the last one. I don't remember what the sample was in the last one, but I do remember getting that. It's like, again, I thought it said six whiteies. <laughs> okay, this one is from The Melt Shop. Okay, does that look like um, Samantha from Bewitched to anybody else? Just me? Just me? Okay. And this is... Oh, that's good. This is Red Hot Cinnamon. Ooh oh, ooh, that smells like cinnamon. I like red hot. Oi. Okay. The next one is yet a, another melt. That's okay. That's okay. It means I just don't have to buy any for a while. Slippery soap, slope soaps. Oh, maybe it's a soap. I, oh, it is because it's wrapped up and it does smell like soap. Oh, that smells good. I don't know what scent that is. Oh, here it is. It's on the bottom. It fell off. Strawberries in Ooh, champagne. Strawberries and champagne. I don't know if anybody ever watched Saturday Night Live and Christopher Walken, he does that. <sighs> I can't think of the name of it. Anyways, the next one is Handmade Soap. And this is from Creamy Greamy Soap Company. And yep, Creamy uh, Shop. I can't read it. If I figure out the name, I'll put it right below there. Creamy Creamy Soap Company. I suppose if you Google, if you look that for that under shops in um, Etsy, you'll find it. You can find, oh my gosh. I think my daughter might want these. Should I tell her I've got them? Should I tell her I've got incense? And then it smells really good. And that I think she would like that scent. Oh, that smells good. And that is in Blue Musk. Well, that explains it. And this is from Galaxy Spirit on Etsy. There's a ton of them. Look at all those. Cool. And we've got Keegan, Keegan candles, handmade soy candles. I don't know if it's a candle. Oh, oh my God. Oh, that's my favorite, favorite ever. 
well, no wonder why it's in lilac. That's like my all-time favorite scent ever. And I didn't get to get any lilacs this year because we had such an early spring that it, the lilac tree just kind of snuck up on me and bloomed and was gone already. So boo to that. Next thing is from Little Black Dress. It is a... I say, yeah, this is Keegan Candles. K-I-G-E-N-C-A-N-D-L-E-S. I'm sorry. I wasn't very clear on that last one. And this is Little Black Dress. This is Glamour Girl June Special. Oh, the box samplers. Thank you for la la la. Don't say what this is. Boo, boo, boo. Something in my eye. It hurts. I'm gonna put my fancy schmancy glasses on. It's a scent stick. I can't smell it. I don't want to open it because it's packaged so nice. Oh my goodness. Okay. I belong to